If you are a business owner and you have a digital product that you are trying to launch, well, this is the video for you because guess what guys, I have found the simple and easy way for you to sell digital products online and the best thing is that is absolutely free. So make sure you tune into this video. We're gonna go through a quick tutorial that's real simple for beginners and we're gonna show you how you can get up and start selling your digital product within minutes. Now the great thing about this program that I found, it's available to everybody. It is simple. You do not need to have your own website. You do not need to know how to code. You do not even need to sign up for any third party payment processing service to process the payments. The only thing that you need is your product and a PayPal account. With those two things, you can be up and running and selling your digital product within minutes. And the way that you can do that is through Gumroad. Now, Gumroad is a website that I found out about a little while ago. With this website, you can sell just about anything you have. It allows you to sell digital products, memberships, courses. You can even sell physical products on this website. If you're the type of person that likes to have like a physical checklist or some way that you can just make sure that you cross your I's and dot your T's, I am going to provide you a template at the end of this video that's going to give you a full checklist on how to launch your product on Gumroad. This template was provided to me by one of my Twitter friends. Her name is Zoish. You can check her out on Twitter. Hey, Zoish, make sure you go over there, follow her, give her some love. She has some great products that are available, some great tools and resources for you. I will also provide you the link in the description down below. So guys, stay tuned for that. Let's get into the details. So the way that you're gonna make this happen is simply go on to Gumroad and sign up for your account. So we're gonna go through that process a little bit here. We'll speed through that. It's a pretty simple process, just like anything else. You go in there, type in a website. It's gonna ask you for some information. You give you your username, your password, and you give them some basic information, your name, your email address, how you wanna set it up, choose your username, all the usuals that you would with any other program that you sign up for. It's going to talk about payments, make sure you pick your time zone and all that other type of fun stuff, right? Then it's gonna ask you to link your PayPal account if you wanna receive payments for your products. I strongly suggest that you do that. Yes, you can give away your products for free, uh, which is what I do with most of my products, but I do give everybody the ability to pay for those, for those that wanna help support Buy Me Some Coffee and uh, contribute into my creative endeavor. So guys, if this is the type of thing that you're gonna find benefit of, if you wanna find more tools, books, and resources that are going to help you skill up and improve your life in your business, then make sure you subscribe to this channel, hit the notification bell so that you'll be notified when I upload new videos on these different topics. So a while back I did a video that showed you how to do a master book database in Airtable. And I decided to go ahead and make those templates available on my website. And I decided to use Gumroad to be the vehicle to do that. So if you click on my website, you can simply go at the top, you'll see templates. You'll see several Notion and Airtable templates that are available for you to use. Not only can you find the master book database template, it's available in Airtable and Notion, but you can also find a template on my exact YouTube video production workflow for both Airtable and Notion. Go ahead, download those templates, guys. The link will be down below. So let's go ahead and get started on this. This is going to be quick and easy. Uh, first thing you need to go, if you want to take a look at my screen, is you want to go to gumroad.com. And yes, I know it's a funny name, gumroad.com. And on that website, you're just going to go ahead and click on Start Selling and you would sign up with an email address. And you type in a password. And you create your account. Now, just like anything else, when you create an account, it's going to ask you for some basic information. Of course, it's going to ask you for your name, your address, all the other type of fun stuff. So once you get in and you set up your account, you're gonna create a username. Let's just call this Paul's Demo Account. Get your email address. Now you wanna set your notifications. Just like anything else you sign up for, guys, it's gonna take you through a gamut of signups. We'll just go ahead, we'll speed through this. You kinda of get it, you're gonna sell in US dollars, you pick your time zone, all that other type of fun stuff. 
Simple stuff, nothing that I need to walk you through, I'm sure. Next thing you're going to do is you're going to choose a category for whatever types of products you're going to be selling. Um, usually it's going to be books and writing, maybe some audio books. Um, we're going to call mine, I don't know, apps and software. Let's just say it's going to be educational materials. All right, so once you hit your update your settings, you got your, your account. Um, it's going to get, you know, it prompt you through how to set up to for your payments. Now, the great thing about Gumroad is that with most companies, and there's a lot that I work with, you need to sign up for their, you know, merchant processing. This is very simple. All you need is a PayPal account. Most of us are familiar with PayPal. We have PayPal accounts that we use. So it's real simple. All you need is a PayPal account, and that's it. If you've got a PayPal account, you would attach it here. You're good to go. Right, so once you have your profile created, then the first thing you're going to do is you want to add your products, right? Now, I don't know what type of products you're going to sell. It could be an ebook, It could be graphic templates. A lot of people use it for like Notion templates and things like that. Whatever it is, we're going to keep it simple. Most people are going to have maybe a PDF file or some type of ebook they're going to download. So you just go in here, you hit new product. And then it's going to give you the option. Is it a digital product? Is it a course or tutorial? ebook, podcast, membership, newsletter. So you can see you, you have a wide variety of options. Now, depending on what it is, you're gonna choose it. We're, for this, we're just gonna say it's gonna be a digital product because for now, we're just gonna use just kind of a, a graphic template, just for example. So we're just gonna say Notion Master Book Database, right? And you click on your digital product and then it's going to prompt you through how to set this up. Name a price for your product. So what I'm doing is I'm gonna make this product free because what I like to do is I like to give away a lot of these templates and these tutorials, um, but you can also allow people the ability to give you some money if you want. So we're just gonna set the price for free for now and then we're gonna hit next. Master book database, you describe it. This is a, and you put in whatever description you have. And then you're gonna upload a cover photo and a cover photo you would create whatever you would use to create your thumbnails or any type of other graphic design um, software that you have. You know, I do have, I use a couple different ones, mostly for something like this, easy enough to use Canva or something like that. I'll go into my Gumroad folder and let's just say this is gonna be my master, Notion Master Database. And it's also going to ask you to know the thumbnail, which is going to be a different file size. You can always click on it, it tells you it has to be 600 by 600. So you just go and click on that and we're going to upload it from my computer. And that is thumbnail. Okay, what do you want the button to say? Do you want the button to say, I want this, buy this? Whatever. Um, typically, I would just use want this. You could use pay or buy this, whatever you want. I'll put, I want this since most of my stuff is free. And then you're going to add your summary. What is it all about? What you'll get is a free graphic And this is where you're going to upload your file. So let's go ahead and we're going to upload something from the computer. And let's just go ahead. We're for just for the sake of this demo, we're just going to upload this graphic template that I just put in as my cover. And they can actually get the PNG file for that. Okay. You can make a suggested amount. Now for something like this, you know, let's just give a suggested amount of $5. You can put whatever you want for it. Ultimately, what it's going to say is that they can download it for free, but it's also going to give them the ability to type in an amount if they want to pay you for it, if they see value in it. Um, do you have other variations of this product? Maybe you have um, a blue copy, red copy, yellow copy. Maybe you have an ebook for 
startups, maybe you have a, a ebook for people that are looking to expand their business, whatever. If you have different variations, you can add that in there. Um, and then it gives you your settings. This is self-explanatory. I don't need to go through that with you. Um, and then you can see as you grow what it's going to look like, right? So this is going to be zero dollars. This is a free graphic image I'm using for a demo. Name a fair price. This is where the person would type in whatever price they want to put. Okay. And then you hit save changes. And then from there, you would just hit publish and you're done. Simple and easy way, guys. If you have a digital product that you want to sell, if you have a physical product, product, if you have a digital product, if you have a physical product, if you have a membership, a course, anything that you want to do, make sure you check out Gumroad and go into the details. You can be up and running within minutes. What's great about it is that it is absolutely free. You see, there is no cost to get started. How they make their money is they are going to take a percentage of everything that you sell, but that saves you a lot of money up front and it makes it nice and easy. You don't have to worry about it. Okay guys, so that is how simple and easy it is to get up and started on Gumroad to sell your digital product. You can see simple steps, walk right through it. A couple of things you wanna keep in mind as you do that, make sure that you have your digital product, right? Make sure that everything is, is, is perfect with the product that you're gonna sell. Make sure that you have your cover art and your thumbnail already designed. It just makes it a lot easier once you go into the website. Now, if you do want that checklist, on how to launch on Gumroad. That checklist is provided right here. Let's just give you a, a quick peek at what that looks like. And if this is something that you want, so this is going to be very helpful because it goes beyond what we just discussed here. It kind of goes through the whole process and everything that you need to do, right? It says you to sign up on Gumroad, add your profile information, create your product. It kind of goes over kind of different things that you would need to create your product. Um, how to set it up on Gumroad, which is kind of what this video discusses, how to prepare for your launch, how to launch, you know, what you need to do for your launch. So this is a very comprehensive checklist. This is great. It's offered to you by one of my Twitter friends. Shout out to Hey Zoish. Check her out on Twitter. Follow her. Go ahead in the description. You can go ahead and download this template for yourself. If you're the type that needs a checklist, if you like to dot your I's and cross your T's. So I really enjoyed spending the time with you. I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope this is going to help you launch. If you have a great product idea that you want to launch, I want to hear from you. Comment down below. Let us know what kind of products you're up and selling, whether you're using Gumroad or not. And hopefully we'll have a, a community of people rally around you, give you some support and help you get kickstarted. So I enjoyed sharing my journey with you. If you want to share my journey in more depth and more detail, then go ahead, sign up for my newsletter, Paul's Weekly Insights. The link will be down below. This is a way for you to follow me on my journey as I share all of my insights, my fears, my failures, my successes in a more personal and intimate endeavor. It'll be an email that I send straight to your inbox every week so you can kind of keep up with me. So that's it. That's how easy it is to get up and running on Gumroad. That was easy, right guys? Of course it was. Very simple. Just follow the process. Um, the most difficult thing is creating the product first. You've done the hard work. You created a product. Now let's keep it simple for you to get it up and post it. So a couple of things I want to recap here about Gumroad. Um, it's simple. It's easy to sign up. You do not need a website. You do not need to know how to code. You do not even need to have any third party merchant processing system other than PayPal. You don't need to pay anything to sign up. It's totally free. You can offer free products. You can offer products for sale. They're simply going to take a percentage of what you sell so that they can help fund their endeavors and keep their website up and running. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope it brought value to you. If there was any value in this video, do me a favor, hit the like button because that's going to go a long way for the YouTube algorithm to help my content spread out to more people so we can help people skill up and improve their life and their business. And I am your boy, Paul. As I always say, thank you for following me on this journey. Hope to catch you on yours. Take care, guys.